Come on and get it. Drop low. Come on and get it. Drop low. Come on and get it. Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of VP Customs. Tonight we're going to be taking out the baffles out of the Tanya's big radius Vance and Himes pipes on their 2007 Harley Night Train. I know we talked about in our previous videos that she wanted them out. Some of you say that it's too loud, it doesn't sound good. One guy called us a wanker if we take them out. <laughs> I kind of like the word, it made me laugh. But uh, She's convinced that she wants this bike louder. I think it sounds great the way it is, but I'm all for the loudness too. <laughs> So anyways, we are going to take them out. We're going to see how it sounds. I'm not going to run it like that for long. With the fuel injection, you want to leave a little bit of back pressure. It's debating either cutting them in half, but we're probably going to end up running the big city thunder baffles. But for now, let's see how it sounds. Alright guys, so we're going to get started. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to take these bolts out here. And um, there's two on top two on the bottom. Basically there's uh, hose clamps around them and they're shield so they're just going to come right off. That'll give us a chance to get into the baffles and the pipes and pull those out. So we'll start with this first. Get these out. Don't scratch your pipes. I know. Now let's just try to take the top one off first. So, looks like we gotta move this plant out a little bit first. And then we can slide it off. Slide it right down. Watch out, that one's on top's so getting hung up a little bit. Here. Here, you work on pulling that. And hung up on the oh, no, you're hung up on the lift. Right, so wait, maybe I can wait. Let me spin it down. Yeah. There, there you go. Underneath those uh, heat shells, they hold the uh, ugly truth, huh? So you can see. Uh... <laughs> kind of like the burn look, though. <laughs> That's pretty awesome. All right. So now the other bolts are underneath. She's gonna have to kind of here. Sit down. <laughs> Sit down. Oh, all right. Sit down. For this one first. Oh, the bolt just came out. It's okay. Yeah, as long as it's loose, right? Yeah. Okay. Let's see how that goes. Perfect. the bottom or the top. Shouldn't put them down like that. No, nope, definitely not. You look in right over here. You're gonna see there's an Allen key on each pipe. On each pipe there. So get the light over here and we'll show. And also it's gonna be important that why we have it out. We're gonna spray a little bit of a PB blaster in there. Help loosen it up. Uh, we'll grab some needle nose, some kind of pliers, and try to rip those things out. All right, guys, when we were loosening the screw, it stripped. So what we're going to have to do now is we're going to have to take this one pipe off and end up drilling out the Allen head screw. Then we can pull the baffle out, and uh, unfortunately, that's the only way to do it at this point. We're, we got a little more work ahead of us now. Hopefully it'll go <laughs> a little smoother yeah. than that did. I'm gonna try it. Yeah, because otherwise we were gonna have, there's no way to get the drill in here yeah. to do this. It's so too tight. small of a space. It's too tight, so it's not too bad. This to one was fine. This one, I think, is loose enough and it's not stripped. It so. is kind of tight back here though, I'll tell you. Right against that plate. Yeah, not But easy. we were able to get that out. So yeah, we're gonna take off this pipe. Take off this heat shield too.
Got it. Hot, hot. All right, so we got it out. We'll mount the pipe back up now. This way, when we're trying to pull the baffle out, we're not holding against nothing, you know? So, here we go, we'll put it right back on. <laughs> All right, after a lot of cursing, we finally got it back on. <laughs> I'm not gonna tighten these all the way down because I want to line up the pipe back here to it first. Kind of snug them up. Then we'll go, we'll finish it off like this. So this fell out when we were doing it. It just holds the pipe in place. Kind of makes it fun to try to line up the bolts again. Shot in the dark worked the first time. All right, so we're just doing a little bit of time on each side. I don't want any exhaust leaks. Probably a torque spec. I'm gonna go like this. Click, good. <laughs> Click, good. <laughs> There's my torque spec. All right, so we'll tighten these up now. And torqued, torqued. This is the one that we had to drill out. So. I have a feeling it's not going to be fun. We'll, do, we'll go with the other one first. Bolt's not all the way out. Oh. That'll help. <laughs> oh. So we... Jesus. <laughs> so we can cut these ones in half. Look at the size of this thing. Well. So, I think if we cut off six inches of this, it'll completely change the sound of the bike. If you look down inside of there, you can kind of see that it's like all these, uh, these ridges. So that's the baffling. So half of the baffling, better sounding I think. It'd be worth a shot. Or we could just see how it sounds without it all together. Oh yeah, we're definitely going to start it up without the baffles in it. We're going to have to. <laughs> I mean, after all that work. Yeah. But we originally thought that these baffles were a lot shorter the, yeah, than these... they actually are. We thought we would have to go with a whole new set, but since it looks like we can cut them, we may not have to go with the... Uh, yeah, with city. the thunder, the yeah. thunder city, thunder city, the big city, big thunder, city. whatever the hell yeah. they are. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so this might take a little bit more work to get this one out, only because we drilled it out. So I'm sure there's some shavings in there. I'm gonna get in there and beat it up a little bit. Of course, this one's really stuck in there. All right, guys. So it's been like five hours later. <laughs> Not really. Maybe like an hour, a couple um, things. Some cur so TV's broken. No, I'm just joking. So I came up with this idea here. I took a coat hanger. This was not coming out for the life of us. We're not the so, only ones, just so everybody knows. Yeah, we, I, I've we, looked around and this has a problem. The bottom one like almost falls out, top one stuck. So this is what we rigged up. He took a coat hanger and we wrapped it through the old hole for the Allen screw and plugged it through. Drilled a hole through a two by four, wrapped it around. And then I'm just using the leverage and we're lightly, tap, that, lightly tapping I'm the doing pipe. This. I'm 
Faust. You, there's so many things I want to call this baffle right now. <laughs> <laughs> What is that? So it is out. That was a lot of work. That was supposed to be a quick job. It's supposed you know, to be. You no, know, it never is. It's never it never goes smooth, but this is the fun of it, right? <laughs> we figured out a technique and it luckily it worked after sitting and brainstorming and trying multiple, multiple yeah. things. Just, I mean, I broke a pair of needle nose pliers on there. I broke the tip right off of them. And, uh, yeah, it's junk powder. It's probably Harbor Freight, but a lot of different methods, and that's what worked for me. Coat hanger and a piece of wood. And a Tanya Harding. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we're gonna get the heat shields back on. Hopefully they go on better than taking them off. <laughs> Better than the rest of this project one so far. <laughs> Perfect. You're in. So the scuffed up the one. scuffed up one from the previous owner. Wasn't you, right? was not me. All right. Well, maybe it was. All right, so for these, we're gonna have to slide them back on from the bottom first. Just start it around that clamp here. Look at that. It's like you know what you're doing. Um, I do know what I'm doing, thank you. <laughs> now I do anyway. That one came out. So proud of you. Look at you go. Okay. Nice. Breaking speed records here. We promised it's not two o'clock in the morning. Definitely, it's 2 o'clock in the morning. Maybe 1.45, it's okay. It's this top one. What's up with this top pipe and baffle and everything? Okay. Oof. That looks exhausting. Yeah, they're really shiny. Yeah. Pipes up after. I'll get you the, the shine, the chrome polish after. Oh, I get to do it? <laughs> That's nice. That's really nice. Okay, go. Teamwork makes the dream work. <laughs> it's a good thing we work well together. Yeah. There you go. Ah. Catch your little finger. Caught my little finger. <laughs> Which piggy was it? <laughs> My middle. <laughs> Do you want to see? <laughs> well, do we wake up our two-year-old and one-year-old no. at two in the morning to start it? No. No. <laughs> no. I want to hear it. Yeah. I think we're gonna have to. I think we're gonna catch back up with I you guys in the we, morning. I, I think we deserve to hear it. <laughs> It's up to you. I mean, we'd have the neighbors to. already hate us, so I yeah. mean, what's the difference now? Yeah, so maybe um, we'll take it off the lift, get it outside, and start it up. Real quick. Real maybe. Quick. Just a little one. Maybe. <laughs> well, good morning, everyone. We're back. We uh, decided against starting it last night. Try to be. We're trying our best to be better neighbors. <laughs> <laughs> it's a goal of ours, so. And it was more for us not to wake up the kids, but 
Yeah, we're back. We haven't started it, I promise. We just pulled it off the lift, so the reaction's gonna be all natural from her. And this one over here is determined enough to take this thing out. It's 28 degrees out right now. She wants to ride it, and uh, she's gonna take you along. So stick around. Nervous, excited? Tell us how you're feeling. <laughs> So, how'd it go? Woo! Love it. I can't feel my fingers right now because um, it's about what is it? Twenty eight degrees, 28 degrees out? out right now. Um, but it is loud. <laughs> She's um, a better person than I am. I'll be honest because I, I think thirty two so is the coldest I've done. Not fun. Definitely love it. All right. Well. Uh, yeah. So, like I said, just to recap, we may put the big city thunder baffles in it. I think it's going to be a hard sell not to put anything back in it because I think she loves how loud it is right now. Right now I was going to ask her if she wanted to take off her helmet to close out with me, but she can't feel I her can't fingers. I can't feel my fingers right now, so. so I can't even get my helmet off. As always, guys, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. It really helps. And uh, stay tuned because we are going to have the t-shirts up on the site very soon. We'll let you that, know. That and our next project is my bars. Yes. So that'll be next. All right. Thank you, guys.